How's it going, guys? Today in this video, we're going to be going over module 16.3, day one. Uh, we're going to be solving logarithmic equations. Uh, we're not going to do it graphically. We're only going to be doing it algebraically. So remember, the log base b of a equals x is going to be the same thing as b to the x equals a. And honestly, solving these logarithmic equations is going to be very similar to solving exponentials that we just got done with in 16.2. We're just going to be solving them kind of backwards. We're going to be changing from a log to an exponential rather than an exponential to a log. So on number one, what we're going to do is we're going to isolate the log. So we're going to minus 7 on both sides. So here's log base 3. 5x minus 4 equals 3. Then we're going to change it from a log to an exponential. So it becomes 3 to the third equals 5x minus 4. So we get 27 equals 5x minus 4. Then we add 4 to give us 31 equals 5x. And then uh, divide by 5 to give us x equals 31 divided by 5. And that will be our answer for number 1. So let's go on to number 2. For number 2, we have log base 4 of 2x plus 12 plus 5 plus 8. Same thing as before. We're going to isolate the log, uh, change it to an exponential, and then we're going to uh, solve it algebraically. So minus 5 on both sides. So we have log of base 4 of 2x plus 12 equals 3. That becomes 4 to the third equals 2x plus 12. Uh, 4 to the third is 64. Subtract 12 to give us 52. And then divide by 2 to give us 26. So the biggest part of uh, this problem or these problems is knowing to isolate the log and then going from a log to an exponential. Everything after that is just basic algebra. Just solve for x. All right. And now for number three. Uh, it's the last problem of the notes. Same thing as before. Nothing's changed. Isolate the log. So minus 2 on both sides. 2 log of x minus 5 equals 1. Remember, log of base 10 is the common log, so you don't need to write the base of it. You just write log. It's the same thing. So 2 log of x minus 5 equals 1. We're going to divide by 2 to give us log of x minus 5 equals 1 half. And now we're going to change it from a uh, logarithmic equation or logarithmic function to an exponential. So we get 10 to the 1 half equals x minus 5. 10 to the 1 half is uh, the same thing as the square root of 10. So the square root of 10 plus 5, we need to move that 5 over, all equals x, and that's going to be our answer. We're not going to figure out what the square root of 10 is. Uh, we're just going to leave it as an exact answer as x equals the square root of 10 plus 5. And I think that's it for the notes, guys. Yeah, it is. Um, it's not too much different than what we've done in the previous modules. We're just changing from uh, log to an exponential and then soft for x. All right, and hopefully this video helped.